Hello everybody and welcome back to Mana Spark. We played a little bit on stream a couple days ago and we made it all the way to the first boss and you're probably like, whoa, if you had no idea, okay, I am like, my entire life is a lie because now I feel like I'm playing Enter the Gungeon. I, my controls are going to be so messed up for this, but that's okay. Uh, we'll figure it out. I've been playing like random shooter games uh, that have very similar qualities and stuff like that for the entire day. We also have two chests on this uh, floor. What in the world? I happily accept. And we get some nails out of this. It's a damage up. Hard for me to complain. I got to get back in the groove here. Uh, the positive thing is, we have learned, one, that there even is a boss at the end of this, or at least partway through it, uh, and two, that said boss is real difficult. <laughs> it actually just one-shotted me. So, we gotta be a little bit cautious. Uh, we've been learning the enemy patterns, we've got it kind of on lock, uh, and I'm feeling good about our abilities to legitimately succeed. Uh, in this game, it's just, we, we, yeah, we literally can't afford that. That's okay. We'll, we'll manage on floor two here, uh, without any extra stuff. Honestly, I think that we can easily beat level two without much else. Now that I've learned how to play. It's really, uh, once you get the hang of it, it's not as difficult, uh, as it is when you initially first start. It's more just understanding the controls. The poison tears right now, and by poison tears, I definitely mean poison arrows, are, are really damn good. And it's like basically single-handedly destroying some of these guys. So I'm pretty positively happy about that. This guy knows where I'm at. That's fine. Get behind him if you can. Get a shot in. Beautiful. And then get behind him. Get a shot in. Is that enough poison to kill him? I don't think so. But if you want to, like, do one of those real quick. Is he dead now? I think so. He's recharging. It's almost like he thinks he has a chance. Good night. It's going well. Uh, like I said, I I've gotten a little bit better at this game. I mean, we did play it on stream for, like, an hour the one day. And when you play something for an hour, chances are you're going to start to get, like, at least a little bit okay at it. I know that it sounded like I took damage right there and looked like I took damage, but I did not take damage. So, fine by me. Have we found the lever yet? I think we did. Or did we not? I, I don't remember. We definitely didn't, because this is the uh, portal and it's locked. Those guys, honestly, just leave them be. They're not hurting anybody. And we know we have to come down here and then through this door here. And hopefully this has the lever. Uh, it does have the lever. It also has the... Rip that guy. It also has the chest in here, which we will then be able to happily take and get a free item out of. Please give me something perfect. An HP up? Hard for me to complain, honestly. Let's get the hell out of this floor. Uh, we have enough money to get all kinds of benefit in our shop here. Get our free item and then maybe even buy something... Special on the way home. Get yourself something real nice. Uh, and I hopefully I'm going to get just some kind of real dope damage up. Higher the damage, better off we're going to be. Doubles it if you're close. HP up. Food luck up, health up. I'm going to take the damage up. And then we're going to take a... Sure, we'll take a bear trap. I don't actually think I've used one of these yet. Uh, but on a crappy enemy, it's probably worth it to try. Basically, if we see Shield Man, uh, we throw down this by him. We already found this. Honestly, there is something to be said for just bum-rushing our way through uh, and trying to just get to the next floor because it's not necessarily easy and I might end up taking more damage than what I uh, want to. So once I find... Yeah, like this right here, this is why you don't do that because that went incredibly poor. And that also is going incredibly poor. Okay, so we're a little bit low on the old health right now. Honestly, this is the kind of time where I would love to just chuck down a bear trap right there. Now come walk over here. Okay, like walk a little bit further. Just a tiny bit. 
rip you, and wow, it actually insta-kills them. So this is pretty positive, I'd say. And yeah, Poison take, uh, takes care of that guy too. So we're looking pretty powerful right now. I'd love it if we could just get a little bit of HP. Uh, and if you would also like to come walk into this bear trap, that'd be awesome. But I'm not positive you're feeling it. Good night. The bear trapper is reusable, man. That is a big game changer. I thought it was a one-time thing. The fact that we have this forever, that is powerful as all anything. Uh, how did he evade my bear trap, is what I'd like to know. But, we'll take care of these guys. I mean, honestly, there's not much they can do when we got our skills on block. What in the hell? I've never seen that thing do that before. Jesus lordy. Okay. Cool. That, that's fun. We're dead. What in the world? Oh, God, it scared the crap out of me. Okay, well, we gotta watch out for those things now. My dear God, okay. Uh, that's fine, though. You know, you learn something new every day. Today we learned, uh, stay away from Blue Mage Man. I swear to God, that thing has never shot out. These are just running speed, nothing too spectacular. Uh, that thing has never shot out the damn, uh the damn fire like it just did right there that was ridiculous okay we still had do we, no we, we got the chest we got the lever just find my way out of here honestly i don't need to be here we got two coins we can get a free item from our shop uh i've heard that pumba doesn't attack if you don't provoke him uh so let's not provoke him we've provoked him shoot off that guy okay no never mind pumba totally doesn't care about me peace out pumba the less I have to deal with you, uh, the less pain and suffering I go through. Give me a great item. Honestly, the poison was really good. So, I'm going to take the poison. It proved to be phenomenal. Uh, and hopefully it'll prove to be phenomenal again here on the second floor. We know we can kill these guys. We've done it before, we'll do it again. Uh, this is a bad spot to be in, though. Because there is a lot of enemies here that want my booty. I don't know what the best approach is right now. Okay. I mean, this this is not really going how I want it to. I'm just running right now. I got nowhere to go. Okay. I mean, we're alive. We got that going for us. Can we sneak our way through here? I would love that eggplant right about now. Just give me a little extra HP. Beautiful. Get sniped. Uh, you need to get a snipe too. Apparently, you don't want to get a snipe. That's fine. Uh, no, now you need to get a snipe though. Beautiful. Get a snipe. Are you dead? You're dead and you dropped HP. We need it right now. Thank you. Good talk. And then you need to die. Okay, you're dead. We're fine. That was a little bit of a sketch out moment, wasn't it? A little bit of money chilling there, a little bit of money chilling here. We got Oompa Loompa Imp Man down here. My guy, I scared the crap out of myself with uh, all of the chaos that just went through in there. We can't get up here yet, right? This is locked. Yeah, we have not found the lever. I thought there was a chance we did and I just couldn't remember it. My memory is never really uh, peachy keen in my life. So, cut me a little bit of slack. You need to die. Uh, and little Imp Man, you also need to die. Thanks a ton. We still got a chest in here somewhere. Axe Man's the scariest. He takes off your HP, man. Oh, and I freaking fell in the trap again. One of these days, one of these days. Today's not that day. Oh, we just shot the lever and we actually just got shot by the damn Imp. Oh, jeez. Okay, one last try for today. I'm confident we can make it far. I'm also not confident in the slightest, but I'm I'm also confident we can make it far. Hey, Tyler, you just contradicted yourself. I know. Cut me a little bit of slack. I've had two rough deaths here. Just seems like the game don't want to give me anything good right now. Uh, yeah, don't, don't, don't do this right now. I don't got time for your shenanigans. We might want to kill Pumbaa for the meat, honestly. 
because it seems that he always drops meat. So, come charge. And then get roasted. Literally, like, give me some roast food from you. Give me an HP upgrade. I suppose that's fine, even though we really don't need that right now. We need other stuff, like damage. It's hard for me to sit here and complain. Shoot, uh, We can't shoot that from a distance. Just go walk and grab it. Don't bug Pumba. Pumba's never harmed anybody unless we need food and then we harm Pumba, but that's neither here nor there. Grab this. Food luck. Recovers life after killing enemies. Damage way up, shooting speed down. I know this is a bad idea. Anything that gives you something way up and something way down usually results in you dying. But we're going to try our best here. Uh, why in the world? That guy charged way faster than he normally charges. But he's dead, so it's hard for me to uh, say too, too much. This sucks, honestly. You need to die and then get one more shot in. Thank you. And then we just got a shield man. Who will continue to be annoying for as long as he lives. And apparently his shots also uh, go through tables. What did I know? Why not? Just make it more difficult for me. I just missed. It's just bad play, honestly. Beautiful. And get roasted. Here's our lever. There's a large part of me that just wants to get the hell out of here as soon as we can. Why even bother? Uh, although there is an item somewhere in here. And the item could be good. So, maybe wait a little bit here. It won't be that hard to kill all these guys. Beautiful. One more. Oh, I freaking flanked it. One more. One more. There we go. He dropped some food. Not the end of the world. This guy's coming at me from a distance. Peace out. Whenever he... He's the easiest guy. You know? He is the... You go to play pickup at the park, and the four, ten players there, and he's like, Hey, man, want to play? He's the guy where you go, yeah, you know what? I'll take the one-on-one -on -one against this guy. A pretty good chance I'm going to win. These are the guys, that you, they're the four ten guys. Because you kind of predict every move they're going to make, and you're just able to block it immediately. Beautiful. And get roasted. Who else we got? Another shield man? Take me by the hand. Yeah, go ahead and fire. Let me come around. A little skirt attack right there. Oh, yeah, that was horrible, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, I'm just getting absolutely destroyed by this man. You need to not do that anymore. And drop some food. Thank you very much. I, there's another piece of food back here, right? Yeah, there is. Okay. I'm an intelligent boy. I want this item. I know I'm greedy. I know we can just move on uh, and probably accomplish greatness in our lives, but I'm greedy. I want the item. I know these guys are going to continue to fire at me. I know that we got freaking Axeman here, and he's the most annoying human on the planet. He lunged out of nowhere. That is not my fault. He lunged so far. All right. Well... Uh, that's gonna do it for Mana Spark today. We are gonna do at least one more episode. It's supposed to be a mini-series, but I can't not show you guys the boss on camera in a video. I know we got it on stream, but really. Uh, so we'll try again next time. If you enjoyed, remember to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a nice day. Bye.